How was school? Fine, I guess. Why? You didn't check me out. Sorry. I felt like you should stay at school. I did not feel like that. <laughs> Claire, do you have any ideas what you're going to get for this birthday party tonight? No, I don't. Welcome back. Today I have been on a field trip with Carmen since 9 o'clock this morning. We just got back to the car. We walked down to a pond that's right here close to her school. We tested the water for the pH balance and the temperature. We picked flowers. We're going to make them into bookmarks. What else did we do on this field trip, Carmen? Um, we ate lunch. We played frisbee with the ducks. We did, a, we, me and my friend Allie, we did a full walk around the pond. Yeah. This pond that is right here close is such a beautiful place to be. There, It has a nice walking trail around it. You can go out there on a paddle board. It's just a fun place to be. So it was super fun to spend the day with Carmen. And now, what are we gonna go do? I have some surprise oh, Carmen has a surprise, you. I forgot. All right, what's your surprise? Okay, so it's an early Mother's Day gift. Okay. Because I couldn't wait to give it to you. So do you open it? This rock necklace that I made you. That's a note that we so Beautiful. So I made you that rock ne this necklace. Rock necklace. That's such a pretty rock. Where did you find this? Um, Miss Stevens actually found it. She collects rocks and she awesome. let us borrow some to make you a necklace. Oh, I love it. And then this note. Okay, what does your note say? I found the pen in her purse and I just wrote it. So, <laughs> um, you it read it to me. mom right here and it says, my mom is the best mom in the whole entire world. She makes me dinner every night and she folds my laundry. Oh mom, I love you so much. You are as beautiful as Kim Kardashian and you have a singing voice like Lady Gaga. <laughs> oh mom, I love you so much. My mom is the best mom. Oh, that's so sweet. Thanks, Carm. I love it. I'm so glad you made this for me. Okay. I'm gonna wear this necklace for the rest of the day because guess what? It matches my shirt. <laughs> How did you know? Perfect. <laughs> All right, we are gonna head home for a little bit until Claire gets out of school and then we'll have to run back down here and pick her up. Carmen and I are already back at the school waiting for Claire to get out. Claire has another birthday party to go to, so we have to run to the store, grab a gift for that before the party starts. But Carmen, I wanted to ask you, what was your favorite part about the field trip today? Um, probably like, Taking, looking for like leaves and flowers to smash into the bookmarks. Yes, that was super fun. When do you get your bookmark back? I think on Monday or Tuesday. Oh, cool. I'm so, excited to see it. Yeah. It was kind of hard to find flowers down there at the pond because it was mostly just trees and leaves and things like that. Not a lot of flowers, so I'm excited to see what you got to put in your little bookmark. We only got like mainly leaves and only a few flowers. Oh shoot. Oh, there's Claire Bear. Oh. Hi. Just fall into the car. How was school? Fine, I guess. Why? You didn't check me out. Sorry. I felt like you should stay at school. I did not feel like that. <laughs> Claire, do you have any ideas what you're going to get for this birthday party tonight? No, I don't. No idea whatsoever? Nope. Not a clue. I told her she needed to have an idea of what she was gonna get for this birthday party because I hate going into Walmart and just wandering around for hours and hours searching for the right gift. So maybe I'll have to just pick this one out. I feel no, that. Mom, I'm 11. You're 30, what, two? It's not. 32? <laughs> not even close, but nice try. She's 34. I know. I, I said she was younger. That's a good thing, Mom. It's true, I'll take it. All right, let's find the perfect gift. All right, Claire, are we thinking toys? Are we thinking cool notebook? Yeah. Craft? All right, I believe the craft aisle is right here on your left. Nope, not your left, not, not that left, this left. These are my favorite markers right here, just FYI. They smell good. I used to use those when I was a little kid and I loved them. 
Do you like them? <laughs> they have all these fun options. Painting rocks, window art, a sewing machine. Okay, so we decided on puffy paint. And a shirt. Which, this is like a 3D paint that goes on fabric. My girls love that stuff. And we're gonna get her a shirt or pillowcases would be fun, Claire. Yeah, I know, but Yeah, you could do like any design on a pillowcase. Okay. I thought we had decided on the puffy paint with some shirts, but Claire last minute changed her mind and we decided that we were gonna do a pool bag. So we found this super cute beach bag. And then we got some diving Some some like little sunscreen, and then we got some like cute paddle. And then a bag that I think we're gonna size up. So all of this will go into this cute bag to make a little pool bag, which I think is a very practical, usable gift. I love it. Carmen is the only kiddo home with us tonight. Everybody else is out hanging out with friends or at a birthday party, and Carmen wants to do some of this puff paint that we got from Walmart earlier today. She's gonna do it on her socks that she found and then probably her t-shirt as well. Carmen, have you decided what designs you're gonna put on your socks? Yes. What are you gonna do? So I'm going to use yellow. Of course. Probably this pearl white. Okay. Normal white. Do you think that white's gonna show up on your white socks? Maybe <laughs> not the white, the pink. Okay. What are you just gonna do different designs or are you gonna do um well what's wait. your plan? Um I think I might I don't know yet. You don't I'm know just yet? thinking. Okay. But let's get started. So this paint, when you put it on there, it kind of gives it a 3D look. It puffs up and it's actually super fun. My girls have done this a couple different times with t-shirts and different things like that, and it makes really cool art on shirts or pillowcases or whatever it is that you want to do it on. And these are dry, I'll do it on the other side. Okay. Whoa, it exploded when I opened it. <laughs> Little messy at first, but we'll get the hang of it. Shake it before you open it. Carmen's first sock is complete. I love it, Carm. Thank you. Once that dries, that's gonna be so cool. Yeah. And are you gonna do I'm the other sock the same or are you gonna do it different? Different, I'm gonna do different colors. But stripes again? I might do polka dots. Ooh, that would be cool. So, I could do black. Just don't do them too thick or it might take a few weeks to dry. Yeah, once me and Claire did ours like really thick, like one of the first times that we did this, we did like a shirt, really thick polka dots, and it took like four days to dry. <laughs> yeah, yeah, this paint, if it gets too thick, it can take a really long time to dry, so just remember that when you're making your polka dots. Yeah. I just don't know what colors I'm gonna do. There's so many to choose from, huh? Yeah, do you wanna help me? Which, sure. one, which colors would you think would be cute? I'm just trying to organize. I love the turquoise. Turquoise, where? Well, I guess it's green. Turquoise green. green. Yeah. Green um, with what? Hmm, I don't know. You got lots of options there. Yeah. Okay, so I finished this second sock. Watermelon colors. And I'm moving on to my shirt. So let's go. What so, are you going to do on your shirt? I'm going to do just random things. Okay. Carmen took a little break from decorating her shirt. She just is getting back at it. Oh. Oh. It's not really moving. So this is what she's done to the shirt. Super fun, creative. And then she wrote her name right in the middle of it. The green, Carmen. The green paint would have come out right here. So I was shaking it really hard, and then all of a sudden, just all of it just goes. Oh no. Right onto the shirt, right there. Kind of exploded a little bit, huh? Yep. But the shirt turned out super cute and fun. Love it. And my socks. And we did both sides of the socks. Yeah, so that's the other side. Cute. Here's this. The puffy side. paint is so fun. Yeah. Guys, I just got home and also Claire did as well. I had to work late on a Friday night. Claire, how was the birthday party? It was fun. 
You watched Raya for how many? Is this the fourth time? First of all, Raya. Oh, sorry, Raya. Um, it must be the third time. Third we, time. We watched like half of it because everyone has seen it, and then we just played like night games. Oh, fun. What kind of night games did you play? Well, we played this game called Spike and Kill. So, yeah. Awesome. Guys, while we were away for Austin's surprise birthday party, our neighbor came over while the technician was here to fix our fridge, and it was very nice of him to do that. It was the compressor. But guys, as you will see, we've got our stuff loaded back in here. Uh, it is cooling down very nice right now. And it was covered under warranty, which is great. Cost us zero dollars. So it is fixed. Things are getting back to normal around here. I'm glad the fridge is finally fixed. What a nightmare. We are so excited to finally have the fridge here in the house fixed. We no longer have to go outside to get our food. It's turned off freezing cold again. The wind has picked up and it's craziness out there right now. Might wake up to a few trees that are down and garbage cans, who knows where. Yeah, I've heard a few garbage cans blowing down the road. <laughs> I'll be surprised if we have a shingle left on the roof. I yeah, mean, it's it nuts out there right now. Yeah, it's wild. Uh, but guys, we appreciate you watching. Uh, we love you. I'll see you guys back here tomorrow. <laughs>